All right. Welcome to Flight Attendant Therapy. I am Tobias. And baby, let me tell you, <laughs> I just got off the phone with one of my good, 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 good girlfriends. And baby, it is nothing <laughs> like being a flight attendant on the road and you got issues. Then you have to work with people. Can I get an amen? Ah, hallelujah. All right. Three things when you know that it's time for you to go. Okay? I got off the phone with my girlfriend and she was like, baby, she said, I just need to bounce something off of you. I said, come on, shoot, bounce it off of me. She said, baby, I called so and so and so and so. <laughs> and these are the things that happened. She said she called her man and she didn't get an answer at first. And the second time she called him, he sounded like he was at the club. And somebody else answered the phone first. And ladies, if you hear me, guess who answered the phone? Shatiqua. Whatever, I'm just making up a name. But baby, let me tell you, there is nothing like being a flight attendant and you giving a man all that you got. I mean, your best. And you doing what you need to do on the road to take care of the relationship. Trying to, you know, make keep the money rolling into the house. You know, keep the kids, you know, in good clothes and good schools and all this stuff. You know, trying to keep some, keep some good chickens coming in the house. But baby, no. Uh-uh. <laughs> uh-uh. Tyrone want to go out and do whatever when you are away. So here are my three things when you know that it is time to go. Number one, <laughs> you come home and there's no shoot 'em up bang bang. You can't get no shoot 'em up bang bang that night when you get in. No, no, no. You can't get it that night. You got to get it like two nights later. No, boo. No. You needs to get it then. There's no Ohio Silver away. There's no Superman Lois Lane. No Mark and Mindy. No Red Butler and Scarlett O'Hara. Oh, no, boom, boom. No, 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 no. That's number one. You need to wake it up because that's a complete, <laughs> that's a complete slap in the face right there. You hear me? Okay. Do you hear me? <laughs> if it's not going on that night, when you get in from a, a, a whole week or a two-week trip and there's no shoot em up bang bang, no, 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 boo. Mm -mm. Number two, <laughs> when you call home, I don't give a damn what time you call. We work crazy ass schedules all times of the night. And somebody else answers your phone, it may be a man. <laughs> you may wake up to, you wait, may call home and a man answers your damn phone. Your home phone. Shit. And then, you know what you need to do? That next morning, what you need to do? Oh, baby, I'm just making you some breakfast. Good morning. Oh, baby, I'm boiling you a pot of grits. Come on in the kitchen <laughs> and have a seat. <laughs> he said that, oh, baby, you haven't made grits in so long. And, you know, oh, just, just. Boiling just some good old grits. Baby, you want some butter in them? Oh, okay. Let me put some butter in your grits. Okay. You want some pepper and some salt in your grits, baby? What about some cheese? Oh, for your people in the South, baby. Put some cheese in his grits. Have a talk and toss some on his ass. That's when it's time to go. That's number two. Number three. Okay. Back up to number two. What if you have kids? <laughs> you need to get the middleman involved. Middleman means child support, okay? All right. Number three, now this is the killer. You, baby, you, girl, I'm telling you, this will really let you know when it's time to hit the dough, okay? You get home. You already know what type of relationship that you got with your man. 16 years and you tell me you leaving me for a, <coughs> oh no, no, we ain't gonna have that, not today. 
not today. But you get home and you know what type of sexual relationship that you have with your man and what y'all do. You know that there's no <laughs> contraceptives. Is that what they call them? Latex involved in the relationship. You know, you may need a little enhancements or whatever, but you know that, hey, <laughs> I'm good, you're good, hey, we're all good. But we know that there's no in the drawer besides what I put in there, <laughs> okay? And you get home and you're just going through, you know, doing the laundry, cleaning up from a trip. You just came up from a trip and <laughs> What is this? In the bathroom. In the toilet. That didn't flush. <laughs> Pause. Turn around. Get your stick pins. Put them in your hair. Call your brothers. Because it's about to be a rumble over there. It's about to be a rumble. I'm telling you ladies. If you stand for anything like that, if you stay for the children, you are wrong. If you stay for the kids, when you know that a man is dogging you out, you are wrong. And you serving yourself as well as your children and injustice. Hell no, I ain't got no children. But I have nephews and nieces that I have raised and I know what stands right in a relationship. Hell, it don't matter if I got children or not. The thing of it is that when you find a condom and you know that your husband or your man is banging others, <laughs> no baby, you get the dunt, the dunts, and it's time for you to go. It's time for you to stage right. So ladies, those are my three things for you. I just had to step up for my girlfriend, and I have a lot of girlfriends, but damn, this one has been in a 16-year relationship. And I like the dude. I like him. But I tell you what, I just, girl, I just got to step to the side right now. And I got to give you some boom, boom, boom. All right. Praise him. Let everything that happened, praise the Lord. Woke up on this morning. Praise the Lord. 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 Baby, I had to get that off my chest. Now, remember those three things, y'all. When it's time to go, it is time to go. Don't fight against time and don't waste your time with no damn fool who don't want just you. You know, if you set the relationship up like that, that y'all opening up the relationship, y'all doing whatever open swinging, whatever swingers, how straight folks do, go to trapeze or whatever in Atlanta, whatever you do. But make sure that it's understood and that both people agree with what is going on. Now, I'm done with that, boo. Bye-bye. Fly safe, flight attendants, but don't be a fool.